eligible and which one needs to be rejected. Okay. On this side, you'll see it take a photo. It takes eight photos to make sure that this component that's here is the correct component that syncs up with the HMI. And it, it takes it to its storage unit and uh, you can also program it so that it ships to your uh, customer. Let me do another one. So, is it possible to detect? Can you just try another one that is not um, the one that is fitting? The one that is not required, that's, that's going to reject. Okay, so the one that's going to reject. Let me okay. just quickly check and see. So you'll see on this production selection, I've selected uh, low cover, high view, and low white. So on this one, if it rejects, uh, I don't think it will reject any of these ones for now. <laughs> It'll take them all. Okay, they don't have a low blue. There you go, that one rejected. Wow. Huh? So it rejected that one. Yeah. Went down there. Wow. Okay, that's good. Okay. How many cameras are there? Uh, so on this, I'm not sure how many cameras. I think it's just one camera, but it takes eight different photos. And it's almost like a heat signature photo. So depending on what you set on your HMI, this one will sense it and also there's a um, amount of standards that set on the PLC for some time. Let me quickly just do this. So I'm not having the standard block that needs to be there so that the um, system can be completed. So the one is in the great size and it rejects it. Mm -hmm. So, it rejects it and because it doesn't have its a standard size. Because this is a standard size. So, the camera looks for this 